Welcome back to Bowling Green Kentucky. We are live at the National Corvette Museum. We've stepped into the education gallery. So much of the museum is for kids at heart, right? But this is really for kids of all different ages to step into this space. Robert joins us again, uh, the director of collections here to tell us a bit about why this was put into place. And I just think it's just one of the coolest hands-on places and everything is cool. <laughs> but this is a space where kids can really touch things Absolutely. and not get in trouble for right, it, right? Exactly. <laughs> no, they're, they're able to come in here. There's a lot of tactile elements here and, you know, research has shown that that's the way you really engage with kids is mm -hmm. get hands on. So uh, the McMichael Family Education Gallery is one of our newest galleries mm -hmm. uh, and the whole purpose is to engage uh, students of all ages, like you said. I love that it is kind of geared for, for different levels mm -hmm. um, wherever a kid is kind of in their education right. journey uh, because who knows? you may have a future engineer out there that visits exactly. you know and and that could be a really cool thing a future uh, Corvette enthusiast who <laughs> knows but just even just with the wall behind us kind of I love this encouraging right. uh, where it's telling the story of how it's assembled mm -hmm. right and all you have to do is flip this to feel right. Right. oh this is what the interior feels like or right. This is what that leather interior, you <laughs> so know? So th this gives kids I love that. And, and adults, we see a lot of adults yeah. do it too. They come over here, they can actually move this, they can touch, they can feel, yeah. and then they read. And so it, it gives it that layer of uh, engagement that uh, just words on a wall wouldn't do. No, yeah. and I feel like you've got this a real life, li you've got a living museum here, right? There's right. one thing to kind of walk around and to see, right. but to get your hands in things and to learn, even up to using the technology right. to design your own Corvette. Right. Right, and that is, you know, my daughter's personal favorite. Cool. Yeah, they're able to come in here and actually They're like draw. little iPads. Yeah, yeah, they're little iPads, uh -huh. and then they can draw, and then they can put up on a big screen. They run over, and they can see it up on the big screen. Oh, cool. Uh, and it look allows I people did this. to do that. What's that? It's like the kids get to see, look what I did. Yeah, you know, yeah exactly. Look, look yeah. how I created that. Let me show you. Yeah, you can uh, design it off of a Ray, a fighter jet, a Shark, or free draw. Correct. Yeah, each of the generations of Corvettes were inspired by different uh, sea life mammals, so mm -hmm. uh, they're, they're, they're able to pick that, and or the you know the fighter jet if it's a C8, a little bit more aggressive lines, or a little bit softer for a C1. Mm -hmm. um, it gives them that opportunity. Yeah. You've had what 4,000 or so school groups already come through this year. Yeah. So last year we had 4,000 total, wow. and this year, just to this point, we've had 4,000. So we're already doubling our numbers, which yeah. is fantastic. I have to, to mention too. I've just noticed at other exhibits. I know it's on display in this room too. Uh, you, you've made it so inclusive to be mm -hmm. here, right? That you're really, you're targeting kids where they are right. and you're helping them learn on their level right. from the braille on the exhibits yeah. to just everything just mm -hmm. feels, um, it's so inclusive here. Yeah. You all have really made sure that that is, that is a goal, everything is for wide sure. for wheelchairs. I mean, it's just very accessible. Exactly, that's a, that's a big goal of ours. You know, our, our mission states that we educate worldwide audiences on the evolution of the Corvette, mm -hmm. right? And we're a mission-driven organization. So education being the kind of the cornerstone of that, that's why this gallery is so important. On another wall, you can't see from here, but I know we have video of it, just how even the Corvette is assembled now right. is probably vastly different from how it was a 71 absolutely. years ago when absolutely. it started. When you have kids come in, is it almost like mind-blowing for them to realize like how quickly a car comes off the assembly line? I think it blew my mind, what, yes. four minutes or so? Yeah, it's very quick uh, from- Four the, minutes? <laughs> conception all the way through to when it's delivered it's it's quick they have it down to a science and uh -huh. it's really fascinating to learn about well I know you're gonna have many many more uh, school children come yes. through this particular yes. exhibit is there one area in here that you think uh, gravity that kids like gravitate and love the most like what's their favorite part of this visit they love designing the that's a big part of it uh, behind us we have a, a secret room studio X oh, what's you in know? The secret room? so that's where uh, at the GM campus they actually designed the Corvettes t about 10 years before they came out so it's very hush hush but you're able to go kind of explore that area I love that that's oh, that's personally, neat. It's, it's very they've cool. done a really good job of taking history and layering it and making yep. it very present and like giving it a context that showing kids the history right. but making it real now right because right? it, people accessible hear history and they're like oh. yeah exactly they're like oh, don't tell me about that i don't know what's going on well we want uh people to come visit i mean if you have your school group you want to book for the fall how Absolutely. do you how do you do that do corvettemuseum.org uh, there's an education tab you can go in there find some more information and actually book your trip there right and i think even for the older kids out there if they want to come and learn like on a group study or Absolutely. something like if they're interested in Absolutely. studying engineering or something mm -hmm. this would be really great so it's so easy to do 
you. If you're watching this and you're thinking, oh my goodness, we got to load up the kids and head on down there. All you have to do is go to CorvetteMuseum.org. Uh, there's a tab that talks about plan your visit just from there and then come on in and there is lots to do for kids of any age.